Ok, so, ahora tenemos esta Buke and Clay. This is a 2010 Buke, GMC Buke and Clay. And the lip gate is not open. You normally press here and it's not opening. When you press here, it, you can just see the light come come comes on, you know. So I do to do the lip gate right like this. See, you see the light that is powering it on. But it's not open it. Alright. Okay. If you do by hand, it's not open at all. Okay, now we just check in the uh, it's a button right here for the leap gate. If you pull it off, it powers the leap gate off, right? This is what it says. Uh, but even like that, it's not working. If you put it back. Switch it like this way. It's not working either. It should work like here. But it's not working. So I guess next time we will do something else. Okay? You know, just double check on this because this one sometimes is off. So you'll be able to lock the uh, the leaf gate. So what we're gonna do today we're gonna to find out what's the problem with that with that alright so first of all we are gonna be access to the back at the at the door through here we'll see, we'll see if we can open it from here alright okay so yeah Move all the stuff out of the way first to be access uh, to the uh, uh, lip gate compartment uh, door latch, which is uh, uh, yeah right there. There's a hole right there. We'll see if we can uh, do something of respect. Okay, let me just move all the stuff that my wife's got on the way. Of course, you know how wifeys are. You got stuff everywhere, you know. Okay, let me go get a flat screw screwdriver, okay? Flathead screwdriver. Okay, so I'm gonna try to get in here. <sighs> let me see if I can move the camera a little bit. That way. <sighs> I say so. Another video on YouTube. Not for this model, but for an Acadia, I believe. So it says, it says uh, something about, there you go. I just push it, as you can see. There's a little tiny hole there. Let me show you if, if you can really see it. Hold on. Okay. Okay. You just press it. I just push it like here. See? See how I'm doing it? Okay. So now we're gonna see what's the problem with it. Okay. That's the way you can open it manually. Um, now. We're open it already, so we're gonna fix what's the problem. Why it's not? We're gonna check power. Uh, see what's the problem with it, with this thing right here. Uh, I don't know what's wrong with this. Uh, 
Okay, so we're gonna open the, the hood, the front of the car. We'll see if there's any, uh, check the fuses uh, here first. So there's a, a box of fuses here, right, right here. So I'm gonna pull this thing up and check uh, the fuses here. And then, the, and then after that, we're gonna check the fuses inside the cap and uh, under the, uh, the glove box okay okay so when I check the fuses here so you can what you gotta do is open these little tabs there's three of them all right so I found the power leap gate so it's this guy right here it says uh, Power leaf gate, I believe, right? It says 30 amps, so we're gonna check this fuse first, and then after that, we're gonna go inside and check the other, the rest of the fuse, okay? So it's 30, it's uh, basically it will be okay. So vamos a, we're gonna take this one off. And see if there's any okay I don't see any problem with it or we can always check with a multimeter to just to check for continuity all right But it seems looks good to me. Okay, so the, this fuse is good. So when I go ahead and and do the one uh, inside by the um, glove box, okay? Okay, that's it from here. All right. And my son is helping me today, right? Okay, so here's the other fuse, fuses right here, but I think, this guy opens like this or what, like that, look. Alright, so I'm gonna have to take this one off right here the little cups right here okay right here wow. okay so we got the top the cover off they just take two two of these that you pull out with a flat head screwdriver I mean you can pull this whole thing off so this is a this is the other fuses I mean the name so we're gonna look for a uh, we're gonna look for a uh, leaf gate, air power, power mode, display, radio, phone. Back up, stop, power mirror. Well, I don't see any, any, any um, leaf gate fuse in here. Okay, now when I go ahead and remove. All these cups, okay? So when I open this latch here. Okay. Hello. 
continuity in this sensor. So the sensor is good, as you can see, when you press it, that means it's good. Okay, so I finally found the problem. What was the problem to remember? I just, this is another day, right? I was testing to come apart the whole trunk uh, to, to see why the lift it, it won't opening, right? But now I found the problem. Now as you can see, you just press it and it's open now, right? I put all the stuff back together, as you can see now, but I'm gonna tell you what was the problem or how do I fix the problem with the left one, uh, the, uh, won't open the li uh, lift gate, okay? So now you can you can uh, shut it off again with the switch and it's working just perfectly. I don't even spend nothing or money or any cash. All I spent it was just time and time. So if, if, if your lift gate won't open, I will show you how to fix it or a quick fix if that's gonna be your case, okay? I'm not saying that's everybody's case you know that was my case you you already see what happened before what I test what I did and the lift gate didn't open until now I'm gonna show you okay okay so there's some uh, I think uh, what I happened it was the uh, uh, my uh, my kid my little kid just do the this program they uh, the uh, how do you say the uh, the um, leaf gate but you can always use this manual for, to proceed procedures when you got the all these right here so okay so to fix the uh, leaf gate what you gotta do I turn it the switch on and then I left, uh, I pressed the uh, the uh, lift gate for f uh, what's five seconds, like this, one, and it start working again, right? So all, that's all you gotta do. It was it was unprogrammed, as you can see. The lift gate now is open. Now I'm gonna close it. There you go. As you can see, so that's all you gotta do. So turn it, for, just keep it for five seconds and you will reprogram the key again. So now this one, it wasn't working before. When we try, remember, these guys right here, but now it's working, you can turn it off, right? But I did try to open it with this way and nothing. I'm gonna try it now and look. Now it's opening. Now it's open, all right? I'm gonna do it again. See? So it's not working well. So hope this video will, um, so what you gotta do turn the switch on and press the little uh, with the key in, in here turn it on and press the uh, this uh, leaf gate uh, button for five seconds 
and then it's, it will start working again, all right? All right. Okay, let me just uh, show you for last time how to, now how it's working again, all right? There you go. And there you go. See? So now it's working. Thank you very much for watching my video. Have a great day.